guys? Woo! We are ready to get after it on this Monday morning. So starting out the week, um, having those goals and taking time to meet some of those goals really helps you get started on that week in a good, just in a really good manner. So we're going to go ahead and get started strong this morning. And I'm outside. It's really nice out right now. The sun's kind of coming out right now, but it's just nice being outside. So we're going to start with a warm up and we're going to do this to jeans on. Let me know if I need to do anything with the music or sound. Looking to see who's all here today. I see some of you showed up. Good job. Good thinking. Good job. Here we go. I told you guys I wasn't going to be here, but I changed my mind. So now we can bring it. Let's just start with the little warm up. Let's just do it. Heel, tap. Woo! Just getting warmed up. Let's pull those jeans on.
job. Here we go. Let's just do some tap, tap. Now, if you want to bring it up a little bit higher, you can do some kicks and lift. It's really up to you. Or here. Keep it going. The bigger your arms, the bigger your heart rate. Weights here, we're just gonna be here and pull up. Just like we're lifting, 
our grocery bags, laundry bag. You can even have your laundry basket if you want. Just stick your weights in there. Something you can practice at on your own. Just picking it up your laundry basket. So we're gonna use our weights though right now. And then the other thing we're gonna do is just gonna be picking them up here and putting them up on the shelf. So we'll have three moves. Start with that cardio, with that side, okay? And then we're just gonna pick up some heavy bags off the ground, or even just from a chair or something. Okay, here we go. Woo! You guys got a little time to recover? Let's do this. Is everyone doing all right? Check in on everybody. Good, glad everyone's here. March it out. Remember, we're gonna start with that cardio. Let's do those side leg, side moves. Here we go. Woo! The only reason I'm adding the water bottle is just to bring up the intensity a little bit since I'm not jumping. You can just do right here if you want. The side lifts. The bigger the move, the bigger your heart rate.
Good job. All right, good job. We're going to move on. Whew, take a little breather. Nice job, everyone. Okay, you guys breathe. Grab a drink if you want. The check is our lighting, or everything okay on our music and sound. Okay, so the next one, Kung Fu Fighting. So this one, remember, we start off with cardio. Okay, so we're just going to do some punching with some side moves for our cardio part. Okay, and then we are going to do some, grab our weights and do some high, high, we'll do some low, or medium, and some low, okay? We might even throw a little kick in there. If we do, and you don't want to, don't do it. If you want to, go for it. All right, here we go. Everyone had a little recovery time? A little Kung Fu fighting. Start with our march. Then in a second, we'll go side to side. Keep that march going. If you need to take a little extra break, go for it. Okay, down low. Here we go. Boom. 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 This is your cardio. You can go real close or really take a big step. Again, you can do this in the chair. Get that heart rate up. Low impact. Okay, I'm gonna grab some weights, how about you? Okay, here we go. Here we go, boom, boom. Let's go middle and down. Middle, woo, up, back to middle. Okay, let's stay in middle, if you want. You feel like you're getting the most out of it? That is 
perfect. Your heart won't lie. If it's above 21, and you probably are feeling a little, little much, but if you are, say, 10, 11, maybe you want to pick it up. You choose, because this is all about you. Okay, next one. We're going to do some rubber band man. So he's going to start with some jacks, or you can do down here. Okay, you can walk him. And then we're going to do our mower that we've done. Again, just like this, okay? Woo, here we go. Start this over. Just always starting with the cardio today. That way you know. You can add weights, some light water bottles, if you want to. Couple ways you can do the jumping jacks. You could go out, out, in, in, like this, with a step, or you can do this way and that way. Lift, lift, you choose. Get ready to move along. If you want them. Okay, here we go. Reach, pull. Pull that lawnmower string. Two and one. Let's go to the other side. Here we go. And reach. moves you do every day. We want to strengthen them, maintain them, make you stronger. Woo! Three, two, one. Okay, let's get back to our chaps. Here we go. Woo! Light cardio, low impact. Maybe we could do With the lift. You can even do the setting. Like this. Woo! And that gets your heart rate up. Nice ab. 
abs nice and tight because I can really feel my abs becoming a part of the picture when I do this. And once I put all the that down that I want, then I'm going to pick those cans and put them back on the shelf, alternating between right and left. That's a little homework you guys could do this week. And hey, maybe you'll even clean it out a little bit. You might find something that you didn't know you had. All right, so we're going to move on. Next one is, oh, joy to the world. So we're going to do some knees pull down for our cardio, okay? You do it here, you do it here. Remember, you can always do these right in your chair, okay? We all have different needs. We all have different levels. Okay, so on this one, then when we grab our water bottle, bottle or weight, you're going to have it here, and you're going to twist this side, this side. So we're going to really focus on a little bit of core. And then I'm going to grab my chair and we'll work on some hamstring curls. Now, I'm not just being loose. I'm like really trying to um, tighten and contract my muscles and lift. Like I'm adding my own resistance. Okay, so I can feel that in my calves and in my hamstrings both. All right, here we go. Gave you a little time to recover. Remember, on this one, we're going to start with some knee pull downs for our cardio. Always give you a little time to recover between songs. Here we go. Woo! Now you can keep it here if you want. Low impact cardio. Okay, we're going to take those water bottles and twist to one side and back. Twist and back. Woo. I'm only moving from my waist in up. I'm not turning like this. Moving my trunk.
good job. All right, we're gonna move on. Take a little recovery time. I'm gonna grab a drink of water. How about you guys? All right, let's see how long we've gone. See what time it is. It's nine o'clock, we've gone half an hour. Whew. We're doing good, guys. Okay, so this next one, we're gonna actually do this um, on a wall. And I don't have a wall right here, it's moved over there, but um, I'm just gonna use this. So we're gonna do wall set. And since I don't have a wall, I'm just gonna pretend like I do, do chair set, okay? Just like that. Okay, then instead of doing my push ups on the wall, I'm just gonna use my chair. Actually, let's just do this. Let's do, you can use your chair if you want, but for wall set, we can just do down and up, okay? So for our push ups, our wall push ups, you just push out and in from the wall. You could do this on the floor or you could do it on your chair, but make sure your chair doesn't move on you. And then for mountain climbers, you're just gonna bring them up, bring that knee up, okay? And bring that those abs in, that's a really good ab one. Okay, here we go. Doing some wall or chair stuff here. Here we go. Our cardio is gonna be down and up. Okay, for our down and up, let's do this. You're gonna go cross, down, up, out, woo! Really making our legs do the work here. Strong legs. There goes my paper. Keep it going. We're almost done. Notice how I'm kind of pressing my chest out a little bit. Kind of like a mountain.
lifting. Lift your shoulders. Be strong. Squeeze your, your glutes. Woo! Bring that down. Hey, nice. Let's do the other side. 
We're gonna start with that toe out, hand out. Okay, ready? And bring knee to elbow. Or you can keep it up. Let's do about four more. And we're just gonna hold that there. Hold. Good job. Now we're just gonna come down into a child's pose. You're gonna open those knees, those feet, and you're just gonna come down and reach. Take a nice deep breath in and exhale. And you're gonna come up. Okay, we're gonna do kind of that same thing, but laying on our back. This is called dead cockroach. So you're gonna have your hands and feet like a dead cockroach, straight up like this. Opposite. Don't, you're just gonna hover the ground and up. Notice, are you doing the same leg or opposite? Good job, keep it here. Hover, 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 don't touch. A few more times on each side. Woo! You can really feel that. Good job. All right, good job, guys. You're gonna roll up slowly, slowly, slowly. You guys doing all right? All right, we're gonna go right back to our knees. We're gonna have one heel toe out. And you're just gonna do a kneeling calf and you're gonna press that heel down. Press that heel back. Woo, nice stretch there and let's go to the other side. job today guys gonna do some cool down some stretching working on flexibility we did a lot of core standing core so we're gonna not do that for our floor work today let's just go ahead and cool down take a nice deep breath in reach up and exhale again inhale Grab that chair and just use that chair even. Woo, and then I'm gonna kind of put my hands here and pull back a little bit. Let's put our ears between our arms, kind of like an upward dog.
flexibility. Those that have taken my class before, we did this a lot. It was one of our test items that we did. You're going to walk it down and reach and hold. We did it with a towel. You put your towel there. Walk your hands. Keep that chest up. job guys all right we're going to come up and then we're going to do our quads now i like to have a little something to balance so it's going to go right here grab and then once you get your balance if you want to let go otherwise just keep it this way. So all you're going to do is let your legs fall one direction. Now you've got that stretch right here in your lower back, but also right here at the front of your deltoid and into your biceps. Hold that there and come back and ready to go the other way. Bye-bye.